Well, welcome back to the Gold Globe Report. I'm your host, Courtney Dehoff, here in Oklahoma City at the AQHA World Show. We have three days of World Show action left, but you aren't going to want to miss a minute of it. In fact, earlier today, we set a new world record in the amateur trail class. Take a look. Well, today in the arena, Angela Wade and a Soxy Dream had a performance fit for the record books. Wade picked up her third gold globe with a 247, smashing the previous record of 240 and a half. A new world record. Oh my goodness, how does that feel? Pretty speechless over here. Um, I didn't even hear what the score was when they announced it, but I'm pretty proud of her and that go today. So she gave me everything she had. I have to say, I wasn't really nervous going in there. She is a superb trail horse and she deserved that win. So I'm glad that I could show her the way that she wanted to be shown. In the junior trail, it was another record breaking performance. Blake Weiss broke his previous world record from 2015 of 243 and a half with a huge 249 and a half on Snap It, Send It, the daughter of Snap Crackle Pop, who held the previous record. Weiss was also the reserve world champion on Hot Lopin Lily. How cool is this? You break the world record on the daughter of the horse that you held it on previously. What's going through your mind? That was just crazy. I, would, I wasn't even aware that I held a world record. I mean, I remember it, but you know, I just didn't even think about it. Describe this cool horse. How did it feel out there? What a performance. She was spot on today. You know, we schooled a lot last night. Um, we knew we were very easy about it. Clint Ainsworth, he helped me school and, you know, kind of got me ready to go in. And so I felt pretty confident going in, um, especially she was my third ride. So I really knew where I was going and I had a, I had a plan. You've got three horses in the finals, uh, world champion, reserve world champion. Do you have to really kind of focus in on each horse or do you just go in and, and do the best that you can? All three are really different, um, like different spots, different placement, you know, stuff like that. Um, so you just have to, you know, you just have to sort your brain out like, okay, this horse says this, that horse says that. And then, you know, there's really no room for error because if you do one thing on this horse that you're supposed to do another horse, it just doesn't, you know, it doesn't work, right? Well, you made it work today. Congratulations on your world title and your new world record. Thank you. I appreciate it. Well, in the Junior Working Hunter, it was Ryan Painter and Penny Cruiser cruising to the gold. We caught up with Penny Cruiser's owner, Morgan Ratajkowski. Penny's a five-year-old mare. I've had her since she was three. Um, she's a really fun horse. She really loves to jump. I taught her how to jump and then sent her to Ryan, and Ryan's just done an amazing job putting all the finishing touches on, and she's really turning out to be a fun little mare. Were you excited watching that performance? Oh yeah, I was thrilled. I mean, she jumped all the jumps beautifully and soft and changed leads nice, and she couldn't have been much better. Well, your open jumping world champion was Hillary Carell and Slate OQH. I've been here five times with him, and he's been top, he got fourth and then he won and then he got third and he got second and he won again. So yeah, he's really consistent. Tell me a little bit about his performance today. How did he feel? He was good. He was he was a little spooky when I did the inside turns and stuff, but he jumped really great. He, he did. He tried really hard, which he always does. So I, I call him at home double clean state because he, he tries to always leave him up. We also caught up with your silver world champion in the open jumping. Marissa French's jumping mount, Miss Blue Gun, also serves as a pickup horse in the PRCA, as well as a junior rodeo partner to French's little boys. I hear that the whole family gets in on the action. My husband and I and my father-in-law, we, we raised this horse and my husband picks up Bronx at the rodeos with her and we've been having a lot of fun on her. And my oldest boy, Jarrett, he won uh, all around in his age division this summer on her in the rodeo, same horse. So she's been taking very good care of all of us. That's very cool. And you actually showed her in the jumping. That obviously went pretty well picking up the Silver Globe. Yes, I was so happy this year. This is my third year. And to come in right right there with Hillary Carroll, that's really, really worlds above. It was special. Well, congratulations, boys. What do you think about this horse? Do you like this horse? Yes. What events did you compete in? Uh, I did the flag race and the pole bending and barrels and I tied a goat and roped. You tied a goat and roped. You did it all. Congratulations, you guys. Congratulations. Thank you so much. 
giving you a little bird's eye view here at the AQHA World Show in Oklahoma City. This has been your Gold Globe Report. I'm your host, Courtney Dehoff. We'll see you again tomorrow.